Okay, so we're live again. Um, apparently, the internet connection is not that great in the field. Um, anyway, <laughs> so <clears throat> we're basically there are lots of lots of uh, different ways that you can do this ponytail. Some of them just have like a little ribbon, or some of them are braided. Some of them loop up, where you would do like a fun loop like this. Um, yep. But for time's sake, we're just gonna leave this down. But I will walk around. You can see there's a lot of volume here. Um, a lot of compressed volume because if I were if I press on this this is solid hair and that's only because my hair is this long rather than the historical cut and I thought it should be noted that you know you a lot of you guys are probably thinking like well I have to have all this volume in the back of my head this this curl right here is actually pretty tight to the head it's nice and curly but it's not out here and that's fine because then you have this lovely fall of hair so I'm gonna just back up so you guys can see that so I think that's really important to note it doesn't have to be crazy poofy in the back. You're more worried about the sides than the top and the back being poofy. So, yep. um, okay, so that's it. We're going to do a really quick, <laughs> Much we're gonna stop this. it and, and, and do it again so we can um, uh, make the video separate. But this is gonna be really fast. So if you think how long Amber's took, wait till you see mine. It's gonna be like it's gonna be a whoop -whoop. five minutes. Quick. <laughs> so yeah, so hang on, um, five more minutes. Yep. And then we will uh, be done with the whole hedgehog thing today. So I hope you yep. guys found some of this information helpful. And um, signing off. Thanks Bye -bye. for enjoying me. Bye.